What is going on everyone? Welcome to the Response Respawn. And today we are going to be playing some zombies on Duris. Guys, I just wanted to bring this to you. It's been a while since I played Duris and it is probably one of my favorites, if not my favorite map in all of Call of Duty Zombies. I just, I think we all just love the way it's laid out. Love how you can just get set up in it and just have a game going. You know, it's it was really one of the first more open maps. It was more... You know, like, Nocturne Tone, very tight corners, very hard to get set up, no perks. Verrocked had crazy sprinters and had some tight corners. And then, of course, with, um, Shino Numa, or, yeah, Shino, Shino Numa, you know, there wasn't, um, there wasn't too many great spots. It was kind of just, like, luck of the draw with the random perks, but it, they were all fun in their own way, and I think... I think that was the best thing about World at War was all the maps had some aspect to them that made them different, you know? And each map you played felt different, and each map just seemed like, you know, compared to some of the newer maps, like I think in BO3 and BO2, a lot of the maps felt like they were kind of just like reskins of other maps, you know? They didn't play any differently. Compared to in World at War, I felt like every single map was an innovation, every single map, you know, brought something new to the table. I feel that way about Black Ops 1 also, that's probably just me picking favorites though, I, um, Black Ops 1 is probably my favorite zombies, I might get some hate for that, I just, I even love, I love the World at War remakes that they made, I loved, um, I loved Ascension, and then you know, I thought Black Ops 2 had some great maps too, like Mob of the Dead, obviously, I like Buried too, I enjoyed Buried a lot. And then obviously everyone's, you know, the fan favorite, um, why am I, why am I stumped? <laughs> oh man, why do I do this? Origins. The fan favorite Origins, guys. Everyone, everyone and their mother likes Origins. And then, you know, I, I didn't honestly play, I have Black Ops 3. I didn't honestly download two, I didn't download any of the DLCs. I don't even have um, the remake of this map, which is kind of sad because I love this map. I just I just never got around to it, I guess. I never I didn't pre-order it. I purchased it during the Steam Winter Sale. We got a new. That's not too bad, I guess. You know what? I think we're going to go in here and get the Thompson. Cuz we have to open these doors anyway, and I'll be purchasing the Thompson. But guys, um, I, uh, I want to kind of talk about a couple things. Number one, I want to talk about um, custom zombies on this channel. I've been working through a couple maps. I've been looking at them. I've been playing through a couple. Some of them haven't been, you know, the best. Some of them just have seemed a little, like, a little weird. I played through a couple. Some of them were way too hard. You know, I don't, I really, at this time, it's kind of, it's kind of like for me, I got, I'm trying to pick and choose some maps. I mean, obviously later, whenever, um, you know, I kind of run out of the maps I want to do, we can start doing a bunch of more custom zombies. But I, I definitely want to find some great maps to do. I tried a couple of them, but, you know, a lot of them are, are uneventful. A lot of them are maps that I've been, I've played before. So if you guys have any suggestions for if you guys have any suggestions for any custom zombie maps that you guys like on here or even on BO3 because I do have BO3 I just have to get a better graphics card because my graphics card does not want to play the game and record it BO3 at the same time for some reason it doesn't it doesn't like to it gets a little bit choppy but you know if you have any like suggestions of any really great maps that you guys think I should play, give me put a comment down below, give me an idea. There's a couple on my list. There's a couple fun ones I found that some big name YouTubers I know haven't played yet. Um, so I definitely want to try some of those. But if there's in general, if there's any games that you guys think I should play, any games that you think I should try to record, tell me. I definitely like to do a couple here and there every once in a while, short little videos, just short little gameplay bits of games, tell you guys about them. Um, 
we are, I think I'm, I'm definitely going to try to keep up the uh, Balloons Tower Defense Battles vids. I, I enjoy those ones a lot. I enjoy that game. I have it on my phone too, so it's it's just one of those games that I can play on and off between things. Um, I definitely want to try to get some Pokemon Go videos out. I know it's kind of stale, but I'm still into it, and I'm just waiting for second gen. Personally, that's once second gen comes out, I'll probably be super hyped about the game again because second gen was my favorite. I I love Totodile. He is pretty awesome. I love Cyndaquil too. Cyndaquil was amazing. Um, and actually one of my favorite Pokemon is Heracross. So that's kind of cool. I don't know what it is about this spot right here, but when I'm recording it doesn't like to... Uh, it gets a little choppy right here for some reason. I don't know why, because it's never given me any problems on any other... playing like any other game. Like I said, like my graphics card is a... Uh, it's only a... Uh, G4 780, but it can handle this game fine. It gets it about um about um 90 frames per second sometimes. I've seen it like it usually is around 60. Uh, it gets Black Ops 3 pretty good too. Black Ops 3 is usually around 30 or 40, but for some reason when I start recording, it drops down to like utterly like slow. And I know a lot of you like 40 or 50. That's terrible frames per second. You need to be getting like 150, but for me right now, with my income, with the amount that I'm, with the amount that I try to play, the amount that I do, um, it's okay. I'm planning. I am planning on getting a new graphics card. If you guys have any suggestions, comment that below. I'm probably gonna be getting a um, a G4 is probably like a 10, 1060, maybe a 1070. I know. I mean, I'm not all up on all this. Stuff. I just need I just need to get something pretty you know a good budget that can still play modern games. The graphics card I have in now I'm I'm probably gonna try to do a dual screen setup so it's not like it's gonna go to it's not like it's gonna go to waste. I'm gonna keep it on this screen, probably get a bigger monitor so I can have dual monitors. And I do wanna build a custom shelf because right now I just have a really cheeky cheap table mostly plastic <laughs> it's kind of like wood covered in plastic you know it's nothing it's nothing special but I do want I want I do want to stress that I don't have anything special I mean I do have a custom PC if you guys want I might I could make a uh, I could make a uh, video about my computer sometime but for now, it, you know, it's like I don't have anything crazy. I have it. I have a. Uh, I just have a webcam. I have my phone. I have a. Um, you know, I have my webcam. I have my phone. I have a uh, a custom computer I built with some with some help from my girlfriend's dad. You know, nothing nothing awesome he he was great I'm so happy he he helped me out a ton and I know a lot more now about computers and I'm I'm so happy about that it's it's been a big it's been a big help and I can really thank him for that that was weird I had some choppy frames there but guys definitely I mean stay tuned for this stuff I mean I'm loving I'm loving um, world at war still to this day, I still love World at War, but I'm just a, I love zombies, and I think that might be the main reason why my Nocturne Tone video got the most views, was just because you guys can tell it's something I like to do, and it's something that I enjoy. Like I said, I'm, I'm not trying to get high round on any of these, because <laughs> they get boring after a while, and I know you, some of you guys are going to be like, oh, you can't do it, you can't get high round, I, I mean... I don't know what it is, but the second I start recording, I do make some stupid mistakes. I think I focus more on looking at the camera, talking to the mic, you know, than actually playing the game, and hopefully I can get better at that, especially when it comes to games like these where you have to focus, and I try to focus, but I, I mean, it, there's still a bunch of fun. <sighs> I mean... If you guys if you guys enjoy this, definitely like I said, subscribe. Tell me what you guys are liking. 
for me, this stuff's great. This this has been amazing. So far, the support I've been getting is it's it's insane to me. Now I remember World of War Dogs were a little bit nuts, especially compared to um, Black Ops Three has like easy peasy like no problem dogs. These ones will try to bite your legs off. <laughs> I remember they had some pretty crazy spawns. Oh, this is not good. Alright. Let's get rid of this. The box has not been treating me good. I'll take that. I will take the MG42. Not a bad pull. That's thing pretty fast. I, I think I need to get some speed though. And maybe it's probably some double tap here pretty soon too. What round is it? Seven. But yeah guys, definitely like check it out. Check see like like I'm saying, check out my channel. I'm gonna be staying I'm playing World at War still. It's it's crazy. I know a lot of you guys probably have seen a lot of custom YouTubers who now since Black Ops 3 now haven't been playing World of War. Um, I know a lot of you are probably like, why would I want to watch World of War still? It's like an 8 year old game, but I still enjoy it. I still play it all the time. It's it's definitely a fun, fun game for me. It's definitely very, it's, it's enjoyable. It's enjoyable to play, it's it's a lot, like I said, I, it's a lot harder than the other CODs nowadays. Not not saying modern COD isn't good, I, I still love all the modern cards. I I don't have Infinite Warfare though, so don't ask me anything about Infinite Warfare, I, I don't have an opinion on it. But what it looks like to me, it doesn't look too good, I wasn't that big of a fan of, um, of Advanced Warfare. Uh, I wasn't that big of a fan of, you know, the whole bunny hopping, the whole running on walls, but you guys, you know, you guys have your own opinion. I mean, probably if you guys are watching World at War stuff, you're probably into the older CODs. I mean, I've been hearing a lot of rumors that the next COD's going to take place in Vietnam. <laughs> or Nam. Back in Nam. We'll have to see, guys. I mean, that would be a great turnaround. I know, I know a lot of you have probably seen Battlefield 1. But, yeah, yeah, I mean, it's, I mean, I think for the most part, a lot of the community is just, like, saying how COD is no, a lot of people don't like COD anymore. And, you know, that's, that's your opinion. I, I still enjoy it. I don't enjoy it as much, but I still like it. I, I still like to sit back and play some COD. I even play some Advanced Warfare every once in a while, even though I don't enjoy it. I don't enjoy it that much. Um, you guys are probably asking, you know, what's some of my, my favorite CODs? You know, what's some of the games that I I like to play? What are some of the uh, Call of Duties that I enjoy sitting down and just playing? World of War, obviously. Black Ops 1 is one of my favorites. MW3. I still like... Uh, MW1, MW2. I do not have MWR yet. I probably will get it here shortly. Whenever I get a chance. It, it definitely... I mean, how can you go wrong with a, any HD remake of a game you already like? I know a lot of people get picky about stuff. So, oh, you imported the pictures from uh, Advanced Warfare. Not Advanced, Infinite Warfare. Or you guys imported the sound effects, and these don't sound exactly the same. But I think Infinity Ward has definitely done some, you know, some great stuff. And they're not just gonna, they're just sort of gonna change. That was a cheeky play. That was pretty stupid. But guys, you know what? Is what it, it is. What it is. Uh, thank you guys for staying tuned. Thank you guys for watching. 
hopefully here pretty soon we'll get out some uh, fresh custom content we'll get out some more videos i hope you guys are doing awesome i'm probably going to try to post again here shortly and stay tuned because we're going to get some more quality vids out and i hope everyone's doing great i'll catch you on the next one